guys, I'm Tori Sterling and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are watching this and you're like, wait, that looks so familiar. It's because it is familiar because I wore this shirt, this hairstyle, this makeup, and I have this background in my advert routine that I uploaded like a few weeks ago. So if you guys haven't seen that video, go check it out. But I filmed to get ready with me like before I filmed that eyebrow routine. So yeah, that's why it's all the same because I literally stopped filming it one minute ago. But I just wanted a spring kind of look. Um, I was just really feeling light and like natural today. So yeah, I've kind of been liking natural looks lately, which might be a little bit surprising, but I wear more natural looks on like an everyday basis. And when I go out and stuff, I find myself wearing more natural looks. So yeah, if you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe to my channel, hit that little button down there and join the fam. Um, I upload videos literally all the time. Like seriously, like every other day pretty much I upload a new video. So be sure to subscribe. I upload a ton of content. It's pretty much all makeup, um, a little bit of lifestyle stuff. So I know you guys are into that because you're watching this video now. So be sure to subscribe. I uploaded Real Time Get With Me like a few weeks ago and everyone was saying that they love that, but they really love chatty and get ready with me. So of course I listened to you guys and I gave you guys what you want. So here is a chatty get ready with me. I don't know why I'm so excited to film, but I'm so excited to film right now! I don't know why, I think it's just cause like, I don't know, I'm just so excited! Okay, so first thing as always, I'm gonna start with the Glam Glow Glow Starter Moisturizer. Let's also not talk about this, okay? They all were good until she just was like, you know what, <laughs> I'm done. I think I'm so much more myself today because I am sprayed, I am and I am going to the mall to makeup shop. I am feeling myself with the tan. I went blonder the other day. The only thing is I literally have allergic reactions on my neck to sweat and a pimple that does not want to come to the surface. She's just hiding out so that I can't pop her. I saw some of my besties last night. We went to Qdoba. I also ran into my ex-boyfriend of literally ninth grade that I broke up with on FaceTime. That was the first time I saw him in like four years. Um, then I'm gonna prime, you guys know I use this to prime, Coconut Skin Smoothie Priming Moisturizer by First Aid Beauty. Estee Lauder Double Wear. Everyone says that they love this stuff and then I bought it and I was like, okay, yeah, like I love this stuff. Honestly, I have no idea if it's gonna match me. I think it's going to. I bought it when I was like pale and I was like, listen, like I get spray tans a lot, so I'm gonna need a darker shade than what you think. So she was like, oh, here, this will probably do. Everyone says you have to kind of work quickly with this foundation because it sets rather quick. So as I just blend it in, I'm just gonna take my beauty blender and buff it into place. Ooh, la la. This foundation is giving me life right now. I have a pimple right there. Who gets a pimple under their eyes? Okay, let's move on to um, bronzer. This is the Chanel Soleil Tan de Chanel. I'm trying to read Charles Gross, but that doesn't work. He always like speaks in his French accent and like I don't because I'm not good at it. Okay, for concealer today, I brought out two to play with, um, but I think I want to go a little bit lighter in the center of my face. So um, I might mix these two, I might not. This one, it's just such an oldie. I found it in my drawer, I was like, okay, I have to use it now that I picked it up. MAC Pro Longwear. This was like everyone's like ride or die concealer, but it might be too light. This is the Becca Aqua Luminous Concealer in the shade Beige. Then I'm gonna take the MAC Pro Longwear and just sort of tap that in on high points. Who is texting me? Who is my manager? Hey Joel, I know you're watching this. Hey, did that do anything? I really don't think that even like concealed anything. Maybe it did, and maybe I'm just used to like looking like I have no under eyes when I'm done. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Shit is about to hit the fan in my group chat. Then I'm gonna go in and bake. I like that barely highlighted me, but it's fine. I'm gonna highlight with this RCMA no color powder. Okay, yep. Oops. I'm like really dumb and it honestly concerns me a little bit because I don't realize that I'm doing dumb things. Now I'm gonna go in with a MAC 135 
it's just gross. And I'm switching up bronzers today. I feel a little bad for always using Hula, so I'm gonna bring out a little shimmery, little shimmery thing today. This is Tarte Park Ave Princess Bronzer. And I'm just gonna set where I put the Chanel Cream Bronzer. Warm me up a little bit. Then I'm gonna go in with a Sigma F35 and kind of just buff in the bake and wipe any excess away. <laughs> now I'm gonna go in with the Tarte bronzer again and a MAC 224 and just throw this in the crease. Let's highlight the mug. This is Laura Geller Gilded Honey. This is like my favorite ever. Really just does everything for you. Ooh, ooh, girl. And then I'm just gonna take my finger and put this on my lid. I did this yesterday, like put a highlighter on my lid. And you know, like I do this technique a lot, but then I always go back in and I add different colors and I add shades, but I just kept it to bronzer and highlight on my lid and I just looked like natural yesterday. I kept saying to my mom, I was like, I've never looked more basic in my life than we went and ate tacos. Like I was so basic. Okay, then I'm gonna go in with a peach blush. Peach and tan is just the way to go. Gold. Peaches and tans are just like the key to life. So for liner and stuff, I'm not doing like liner. As surprising as that sounds, I'm just doing the lashes. Oh god, oh god. I'm gonna be so, I'm gonna chill my inner Desi Perkins right now. Use a handheld mirror. You can, you know, obviously do this without fake eyelashes, but I'm me. And I wouldn't be able to do this without big lashes. Also, I just look so weird without eyebrows. Like, am I even a human? The answer is yes, I am a human. But am I complete? The answer is no. Uh, the lashes that I'm using are Ardell Wispies. You guys know. Um, I get a lot of questions asking if I reuse my Wispies. Um, and yes, I reuse my eyelashes for as long as I can. Uh, the more used they are, the more I like them on my eye. I think they fit my eye much better when they're used. Yeah, let me go put on my brows and I'll be right back. Okay, brows are on, but um, I think I wanna add a little bit of lower lash. So, I really tried to, you know, step out of my comfort zone a little bit and not do that under my eye deal. But, I mean, it's me, like, who do I think I am? Oh, I put lips on too, well, I'll tell you guys what the lip is. I'm really not that crazy about it, but I literally am like making myself not wear nude because it's all I wear. I'm like, Tori, you have so many other lip products. Literally, I have like three drawers of lipsticks and I use the same one. Mm -hmm. Let's put a little highlight underneath these brows, shall we? For my lips, I just put on a little bit of, oh god, what is this, Sta Staunchly Stylish by MAC. I don't know, and then I threw on this gloss. This is the Too Faced Sweet Peach Gloss in the shade Peach Side. So these two together is what I have on my lips. I guess that concludes this. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you guys all enjoyed this. If you want to see another Try to Get Right With Me, I have one right here. Everyone loves this video for some reason. I don't really know why, but I think you'll like it too. And then I also have my last video right here. If you guys missed that, don't miss it. Whatever. Just click right there. Watch either one. Whatever you guys want. I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.